stealing contracts you burnt a farm killed my brother you had too many brothers they needed calling you're fucking dead aren't we all we live and we die that's our curse hey you want to expedite the situation come fucking find me vespucci beach los santos you inbred hillbilly fuck i'll be there man i don't know when but i'll be there Bunch of government shitbags and their favorite stoolie. What's he been telling you? Oh, he just said how you guys were happy to help the government in any way you can. Oh, really? Huh? Because I was told that if we helped out with that thing, which we did, then our past indiscretions would be forgotten in a haze of patriotic fervor. Who told you that? Did I tell you that? I'm in charge here, Fruity. Me! You understand? Uh, not quite. Well, can you explain that again? What I was saying! <laughs> oh, you're good. The three cunts! Listen, we need help with something else. Some of the government, some of it is pretty corrupt. <laughs> not, uh, not your bit, right? Yes, but we're corrupt in a good way. But the agency? They want to encourage panic so they can guarantee their budgets. That's how they get paid. It's a major problem. And now they've secured some funds that we need to use in our fight against crime as a way of bribing corrupt officials. Really? Then where are they getting that from? Drugs. Those bastards love to sell drugs. Who doesn't? <laughs> we think they're going to use this money to finance a war on our streets. And we need you boys to requisition that money for us. The bonds are leaving the terminal in an armored car. Yeah, fuck you, Dave. We don't have time to prepare the right way. <laughs> it's not my concern. I cannot allocate any more resources to this. You'll be fine. Fuck you, Dave. Nice work, Slick. We're gonna be doing pat-downs at the airport before those fucking clowns are done with us. You know, fuck you. Hey, hey, look, man. It is what it is. Now, how the fuck we gonna get this done? I don't know. Travis Carl there. I got it. Helicopter. Classic blitz play. It's an industrial area, right? So I'm thinking vehicles. Trash truck to block, tow truck to sack them. Get some disguises, and we're golden. We just gotta hope like hell these are the kind of agency men that don't carry a panic button with them. If they are, we deal with it. If and when. If and motherfucking when. 
I will keep my eyes peeled, General. Thank you, Michael. Hey, no problem. No, really. Guys, a few more details. We'll need boiler suits and masks for this job. The garbage truck. Let's get one from your park. Bring it back to the lot. And there's an auto repair place by the airport where we can get a tow truck. What else? Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get away. That would be nice. Get something fast and discreet. We park it off the road a good distance from the lot. And make sure it ain't near something we'll crash into driving off. That's it. All right, man, I got you, dog. What? Huh? I missed that. Maybe shout a little louder? Bite me. Fool, you're a blind I'm fucking sorry. fool. We have a getaway vehicle ready and waiting. Good work, T. Where'd you put it? La Mesa. Let's go. 
let's go. So it's too long. Tow truck is at the lot. Did you hear that's a phone call? Well, I guess, yeah, because they probably would have come to go find themselves. Speed. Come on. Oh, 
Sanitation truck's there now, so don't you bother. can come off the shopping list. Down, dude. 
Just to say, I got us some headgear for this masquerade balls up. All right, that's everything. I'll call Steve, tell him we're ready to move on this. Okay, that's everything. This motherfucker clean. You didn't take your car, you took that horrible piece of shit out. Really? What's all we got here? Hey, give. Go. Out. Now. There we go. Uh. This isn't happening. Not to listen, unless to watch.
truck out there, man, but you gotta have faith, man. Huh? Hey, what's up, homie? What's up, homie? It's all good. My dad's really happy with me. He loves you, too. Your dad loves me? Oh, he loves everybody. <laughs> That's cool. Yo, like, even when they catch his wave, or when he gets cut in line at the amusement park, or even when he orders a chai latte, and somebody steals it, and then the man's like, who in God's name ordered a chai latte? Oh, shit, he sounds like a cool dude. I mean, he used to be a little bit nasty, but then I came around and he dropped out. Man, I never really knew my dad. Yeah, he's kind of distant, though. I mean, he travels a lot. It's kind of crazy, but I, I still really love him. Oh, oh, God, no! What's up, man? Sit down and face forward. Okay. Now, I don't have a lot of time. I know you need money. Did Michael tell you about Life Invader? Oh, shit. Y'all two did that? Look forward. We're two strangers having a friendly chat. And don't pretend that you liked Jane Norris. Oh, man, I don't know, homie. I mean, you yeah, dude all sorts of worked for child slaves. Then stole and sold everybody's private information. And even ripped his own friend's ideas off and walked around like the Messiah while doing it, but... Man, I don't think the nigga deserved to have his fucking head blowed off on TV. Oh, well, aren't you just a moral majority? You know, that's why the world is the way it is today, when a paid thug gets all namby-pamby when someone asks him to act like a paid thug and for a good cause. Man, check this out, homie. I like blowing motherfucking fools' heads off just as much as the next psychotic <coughs> asshole. But I just don't look at the shit as doing a good deed. Well, now you can, because it's not fools' heads, it's assholes' heads. And not just heads, you know, trashing cars or planning lies, forging evidence, anything we can do to take the battle back to these turds. You know, we'll fix the market in our favor and we'll right a few wrongs while we're at it. <laughs> Shit, okay, cool. Right, so, you heard of Mollus? Hell yeah. Okay, so there's a new Mollus, sort of a super Mollus, and it's called Priapolds, and it's giving the living rigor mortis. Only Brett Lowry, CEO of Bilkington Research, paid off the FDA, and he doesn't care that his hardness pills are giving desperate middle-aged men the world over heart attacks. Damn, man, that sucks. Yeah, it does. Now, Mr. Greedy Lowry is staying at the Von Kastenberg Hotel in Richmond. Of course, he'll be well protected, but if he goes away, then America goes back to using Mollus, and Beta Pharmaceuticals gets a big bump in the price of their stock. Damn, man, all right, fuck it, I got you. I thought that you would. Now, consider using a sniper rifle or sticky bombs, you know, whatever. Do it your way, however you want. I'm gonna make the investment, and we don't speak about this or anything. Now walk away, and I'll stay here till you're gone.
Somewhere else to park. So you choose that. Keep your eye out for anything unusual. Just see what you Man, you get what you give out, Mr. Lowry. It's done. I know. Good work. All right. Well, she. Let me know about the next thing. We'll do. Uh, but before that, I've got to tell you something. Our investment portfolio is getting a little uh, successful, so I figured we needed some tangible assets, you know, property. So we bought a house in the Vinewood Hills. Yeah, sure, man. Whatever. You know best about this shit. And we needed someone to live there you know, for tax purposes, so some guys are moving your stuff in. Oh shit! <laughs> Meaning I don't have to live with my crazy ass aunt no more? Man, I don't know what the fuck to say, dawg. Don't say anything, especially if a man in a suit comes to the door. Ah, I'm joking, that probably isn't gonna happen. It's yours, enjoy it. 3671 Wispy Mound Drive. Let's go. 
Hey, Mike. Hey, I spoke to Steve. We're ready to move. I gotta take the loot to this guy me and Trevor met, Devin Weston. Big time investor or something. Oh, all right, see you. Well, I'll see you at the lot. I'll get you the device now. Not the car! Let's go see what new place looks like. so far away Ooh, too close! That's dumb luck right there. What's cracking? What's he at? Right there. So we really finna do this shit? We finna risk our lives to rob some motherfucking government killers again? Yep. Hey. All right. All right. Let's sit up. Here's the plan. All right, Trevor. Yeah. I want you in this position up here. Yeah, you're on lookout. Give me a heads up when the armored car comes by. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna be right here in the garbage truck blocking the roadway. Franklin, you're in the alley. 
and tow truck. Hope is they pull right up in front of you. When they do, you come at them hard. Bam. Shit, <laughs> here's hoping. Yeah, after the hit, we blast open the doors, grab up all the cash, bonds, whatever it is, I take it to Haynes' guy. It's all a little hopeful, homie. As long as I am not on the ground when the shit goes down. Okay. When the shit goes down, we'll handle it. You stay up here, on your post, eyes peeled. Yeah. Okay. We'll take the risk. Sound cool? Yeah. Shit, you the professional, Sounds dog. Okay. And at least we're not wearing clown outfits. There's a plus. Right. The masks. What? <laughs> Let's see what we got. Huh? Yeah. Really? professional. Exactly. You picked them out. Well, we did, but you know. Let's do this. Let's go, let's go. Okay, give us the slowest vehicle game. Let's go. I'm in position. What's the ETA? Hmm. I got a visual on the target. Should be with you any moment. All right, Mike, move it. Let's go. Get moving, him. Across both lanes, remember. fast, is it? Sanitation aren't meant to be here today. Hey man, I got these motherfuckers! Thank 
Shit, that trash truck is trash, dog. You good? Nice work. I'm about to meet this guy. I'll tell you how it goes. Okay. Uh, listen, we're going to her. Got a package for Devin Weston. Package for Mr. Weston? Come on. Yeah, and I'm telling you that I don't give a flying fuck. <laughs> there you go, there you go. Boom! So long, motherfucker! Devin Weston. Yeah, I remember you. The weekend interrogator. Invest wisely. Hey, hey, hold on, hold on. We're not done here yet. I got a job for you, bro. Five top quality scores, big ticket cars, major payday, bro. Sounds great. I got just the guy for you. I'll put you in touch. No, 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 no. I don't want just some dude. I want you. I want your crew. I want pros on this. Yeah, I don't give a fuck what you want, pencil neck. I let them know you're interested. I guess I just got you figured wrong, man. Hey, what's the figure? Tell me something. You like football? I got a stake in a sports investment venture. You like the market? I got some funds you can manage. Name your poison, man. I just like sitting around watching old movies. Oh, there we go. How about I hook you up with Solomon Richards? Bullshit. Solomon Richards, the movie producer? Yeah, he's retiring, man, and I'm doing a finance deal for his studio. I will make the connect just as soon as you... <sighs> All right. Oh, man. Solomon Richards. Have a good one, boys. And there we go. So we can make any money whatsoever on that. Again. Hey, man. Listen, I got an interesting opportunity for you. Acquaintance of Dave's. An FIB contact? Are you joking? Relax. The guy's private sector. It's very well. Could be lucrative. Why don't you meet him and see what you think? All right. All right. Yeah, yeah. I'll think about it. All right. Me and Trevor will be there, too. I promise you. It's a step up for you. A real opportunity. 